33 says, find the horizontal isotope. Do you know what is a uh, horizontal isotope? Yes. The one we just did is these lines here are called the what? Vertical isotopes. The isotope. vertical isotopes. But this time we don't look for vertical. What are we looking for? Horizontal. The horizontal isotope. So what we're looking for is a line that go across like this. So the graph could either go on top of it, on the bottom of it, but it cannot intersect. So I'm just roughly sketch it here. It can go like this and it go like that, but it cannot pass it. So this little red lines right here is called the horizontal isotopes. Okay, so let's take a look at our problems here. Um, to find the horizontal isotope, we don't look for the domain, but what we're looking for is three special cases of degrees. So case number one, is where you're looking at the degrees of a polynomial. So what's the degrees? Um, the highest power on the top compared to the highest power on the bottom. So if top is equal to the bottom, then um, to look for the HA, what we do is we look for the coefficient. So it's a coefficient on top, put it over the coefficients of the bottom. Does that make sense? Okay, let's give an example later. And case two is where top is l less than, than the, the bottom. bottom. In that case, and the HA is really easy. The HA is just Y equal to zero. Case three is where we have the top is bigger than, than the, the bottom. bottom. Then the HA is going to be an oblique line. And oblique lines, it's those lines that are either going to go sideways or it's going to go down that way. So those are the oblique lines, and that's going to have to do long division. Okay, so as soon as on the test, long division, we're not going to, we're not going to have enough time. But just keep, remember, keep in mind, case three is going to be an oblique, and you have to go through the long division. So now let's look at your problem, the uh, original problem that we have up here, x squared over x squared. So what case does that belong to? Case one. Case one, because they're the same. So then what is the coefficient on top? Y is equal to the coefficient on the top. What's the coefficient on top? In front, What's the number in front of x squared? One. One. How about the bottom? One, two. One, so therefore the HA, the vertical, I, the horizontal isotope for that problem is one. one. So this line, the red line, is y equal to 1. What's our solution? Our solution would be a. That would be a. Good job.